Say it without words. Cultural norms for nonverbal farewells. Hello, language explorers. Today, we'll delve into a fascinating topic. How to say goodbye without using words. You'll learn how nonverbal cues vary around the world and their importance in creating meaningful connections. So let's wave hello to our journey into the world of nonverbal farewells. To begin, it's crucial to understand that nonverbal communication encompasses all the ways we communicate without using words. This can involve facial expressions, body movements, gestures, and even our silence. During farewells, these nonverbal cues often play a major role, sometimes even more than the words we say. Now that we know what nonverbal communication is, let's explore some universal nonverbal farewells. The most common one is the wave. Typically, a slow, open-handed wave indicates a friendly goodbye. Another widespread nonverbal farewell is the nod, a quick up and down movement of the head, which is often paired with a smile. Remember, these gestures can vary in meaning depending on the context and the culture. Moving on, let's explore how different cultures say goodbye non-verbally. For instance, in Japan, a bow is a respectful way to say goodbye. The depth of the bow can indicate the level of respect. In France, a cheek kiss is common, though the number of kisses can vary by region. In New Zealand, the Maori people use the hangi, a traditional greeting where people press their noses together. While it's also used to say hello, it can serve as a farewell too. These are just a few examples, and there are many more across the globe. Understanding the context is crucial when interpreting non-verbal cues. For example, in a formal business setting, a firm handshake might be the preferred non-verbal farewell, while in a casual setting with friends, a hug might be more appropriate. Always remember to consider the relationship, the setting, and the cultural norms when choosing your non-verbal farewell. So there you have it. We've taken a whirlwind tour of the world's non-verbal farewells. Remember, these cues are just as important as the words we say, and understanding them can greatly enrich your communication skills. We hope you enjoyed this journey and feel better equipped to say a wordless goodbye, no matter where you are. Until next time, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep communicating.